Welcome back guys. iOS 16 new lock screen depth effect is cool as hell. Have you tried it? I saw some of the people reporting about the iOS 16 lock screen depth effect is not working on their iPhone. So I check it out. Depth effect not working is because of three main reasons. One, not supported device. Two, not supported image. Three, not setting it right. Let us solve these one by one. First, you need to make sure your iPhone model is compatible with the iOS 16 new feature. According to the information online, the lock screen depth effect and some of the iOS 16 features only available on the device with the 12 or newer chip, which are these devices. But iPhone 8 and newer iPhone models are supported by iOS 16, just some feature is not supported. So it's unfortunate, if you are using the not supported model, then the depth effect and some of the feature is not able to use on your device. Now you can see the iPhone on the left is the iPhone 13 Pro. The iPhone on the right is iPhone X, which is an A11 chip. They are both running iOS 16 and now set the same photos as both iPhone lock screen. You can see only iPhone 13 got the depth effect on the lock screen. iPhone X don't. No matter how you crop or move the photo, the depth effect just won't show up. But when I use the default lock screen on iPhone X, which these photos are made by Apple, the depth effect is working. Maybe not just because chip, the screen size also matter. Or it might be just Apple did adapt iOS 16 with all the iPhone model very well. So if your lock screen effect not working on your photos, you can use those default photos. Not your favorite, but still got the depth effect on. At least on my iPhone X, it does. Second, the depth effect has some requirements for the photos. Photo's main object cannot cover too much of the time part, which means your photos must have enough room on the top. You can see the same cat here. I crop it to a different size. The one with the bigger cat is not able to use the depth effect. I guess it's because if the depth effect is on, the object will cover too much of the time on screen. You are not able to see the time clearly. Also, in terms of aesthetics, the whole screen is not very good looking and Apple will not allow this situation happen. So all you can do is try different images. There is currently no statement stating what kinds of images are not applicable. Human Building Mountain Anime character Cat The depth effect are all working fine in these photos. You need to try to understand this feature by yourself. That's not very cool, Apple. Third, if you confirm your photos are okay to use depth effect but it's still not working, then you are setting it wrong. First you need to make sure you enable the depth effect. In Customize, tap the little three points icon here. Tap it to enable the depth effect. If you didn't enable it, the depth effect will not appear. Second, delete those widgets if you want to use depth effect. These widgets must remove or the depth effect won't work. Remove them one by one and you will see your depth effect is working. What a nice design Apple. If after you try all these, still not working, you can try to refresh your system. Just use Tenorshare Reiboot. You can find the link down below with just a few clicks. Reiboot can refresh your iPhone system and then the bugs might go away. Feel free to try it. Okay. So far these are what I learned about the depth effect. Hope these tips can help you. If you want more specific detail, you can ask Apple and if you know more about the iOS 16 depth effect, please leave a comment to let us and other people know. Thanks for watching. If you subscribe, I will be grateful. Hope to see your guys soon.